especially through um, you know, a lot of a lot of the things that I've been through uh, within the last two or three years. You know, we had a great training camp. Um, you know, I was in shape like I haven't been in uh, you know, years. And um, I want to thank, you know, they were the promotions. I want to thank Mr. Uh, Yes. Uh, my man Al Haley, Sam, the whole crew. I want to thank my team as well, uh, you know, Virgil Hunter. Uh, you know, my foundation, man, you know, my parents, you know, my papa, you know, my, you know, my, my, there she is, man. She made her way up here. That's my beautiful mother right there. And uh, that's my whole clan right here, man. My brothers, my sisters, my cousins, my girl, Portia, my mom. You know, y'all come up here too. Y'all stand up here, man. I wanted to see what, what, you know, what drives me, man. So y'all come up here, JP. Y'all stand up right here.
you know, like you know, like I said, you got to put in, you know, I don't know, you know, 20, you know, 30 some odd years, you know, and I hear, you know, busting his ass running and, you know, training, fighting. And at the same time, you know, being able to stay on the feet and take care of all of these damn uh, people. <laughs> she never knew the hell they want to do. Uh, did you feel like the fight was closer than the scorecard suggested? Yeah, I believe so, but you know, it is what it is, man. I'm, again, like I said, I'm here, yeah, I'm in this hometown, and uh, you know, there was a lot that was on the line tonight for him. So, you know, of course, I knew that the score was a lot closer, but like I said, it is what it is, man. Like I said, he deserved everything he's, you know, he got tonight. Right. What do you personally take from this entire experience of having participated in this fight with Bay Yeah. I mean just everything, man. This whole experience is just was just amazing for me. You know, this is a situation that that all you know us as young kids, you know, come in this sport, you know, in general, to be here at a big ass press conference with all these cameras in your face. And, and, and you know what I mean? You know, fighting on paper if you. I mean, ain't nothing like it. You know what I mean? So I, now I can't look at the situation and, 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 and just, you know, think it was a bad situation for me. You know what I mean? Like, coming from where I come from, you know, like we've always been underdogs. You know, we're not, we're not known to make it out. I got my whole family here, and we're here to be able to put on two minutes of performance tonight. Um, you know, so I gotta be happy because of that, for sure. Right here, Andre. Hi, um, how does one of you feel about situations, you know, that he couldn't really, you know, he's not a big value in the country. You know what I mean? So if he can get off, I see him take deep breaths. I see him take deep breaths. Take deep breaths. So I'm going to talk to him. But I can know what it is. But like I said, he's very smart. He knows how to, you know, he knows how to take his time. He throws a combination of punches. He can walk. He won't walk. He won't take his deep breaths. He won't walk. Keep thinking that shit. You know what I mean? You come at it, he's gonna tie you up. You're gonna, you gonna hear him in them clinches, but like I said, man, I mean, I mean, it's part of the game. You know, you have to be, you just, I mean, you have to have a lot of different, you know, situations about you. He's been in this game, I mean, long enough to know how to handle it. He's not going in his goal balls. You know, I mean, the balls to the wall with me. You know, he's gonna stay smart and he does what he does. Andre. 
How you doing, Andre? Yes, sir. Uh, a lot more people know who Andre Burrow is now. Yeah. Uh, tell us a little bit how this experience has changed you, uh, what you learned from it, what you learned you know, in the ring by being in Floyd Mayweather, and how do you make sure that now that so many people do know who you are, that your career has an opportunity to not go back on an upward kind of spoke, and you don't want to go back to you know, the way it was? I mean, um, like I said, when I went through all my life for a reason, you know what I'm saying, I don't, you know, I'm in a position right now that, you know, I don't see anything in my life that happened two or three years ago, and look down on it, because it happened to me for a reason, you know what I mean, it had to grab me and shake me up for a minute to get me focused, and, and you know, coming back from the show and surgery and other situations, you know what I mean, you know, it's got me focused and let me come back stronger, and when it appeared. And you know, this whole situation just made me know, let me know that I can handle it. You know, from, from press conferences to wins to, you know, stepping in there, you know, with Floyd Mayweather on pay per view. Like, I wasn't, you know, I wasn't shaken up by it. By it. You know, I came to fight as Robin Sidney, right? And at the end of the day, so I think uh, I'm going to take this experience and continue to move forward. It's going to make it's going to make me greater, for sure. Andre, missed the four minutes of high effort. I'm sorry, man. Uh, uh, what did you say that Kenny Davis broke you guys up? What were you guys saying when you each other? I was talking to him. That's what I'm going to do. You know, that's me, man. You know, I like to flip the script from time to time. So, you know, I'm just in the top of the tone. You know, I'm just asking him to, you know, let's go to dinner after this. <laughs> But now, um, I am just talking a little less to him, and, 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 and uh, you know, just, I mean, it's any time I was able to you know, hit him with my jab, and I was talking to him, and, you know, yeah, I mean, it was a lot of fun to talk, right? And talk, right? So it was just, just some back and forth battle. You know, like I said, you know, he knows how to get everybody else's head, so I was kind of, obviously, kind of mess with him a little bit. I appreciate everybody, man. I appreciate you for the support.